Welcome to this bonus episode of The Compressor Guru. Watch as The Guru shows you how to service the oil bath air filter on a 10 horsepower 1963 Kellogg air compressor. This is an old one, folks, and one you're going to want to watch. And now, here's The Compressor Guru. Welcome back to The Compressor Guru. We're here at TD Fab and Weld in Clearfield, Pennsylvania. And we're just doing standard maintenance and service to oil change, filter change on a couple compressors. I'm not going to show all that, but what I do want to show you is we have an old-fashioned old style bath oil filter. And we're going to show you how to uh, clean this out put fresh oil in it and put it back in service. Real simple. There's a wig nut on top. And this will be messy. There's our oil filter. It's actually oil that runs through a maze of mesh and it's an oil bath air filter. We're going to take you out to the truck. We're going to dump, dump this out and we're going to clean up the can. And you can see the dust that was trapped in the oil that settled to the bottom in there. Mm -hmm. Now if I had a can of gasoline, I'd just fill that with gasoline. But we have our ever-present brake cleaner. Get down in there, like the residual Brought it out. Get a rag. back inside where it's warm. <laughs> Same oil goes in the crankcase, we'll fill to this line, then we'll clean the element, put it back together.
this just became a bonus episode because we actually realized, can you see? We actually realized that there's a lot of you young fellas that may have never seen a filter like this. And we're right there at the line. That is full. All we have to do is clean our filter element now. Go back outside to do that. And the element's not in very bad shape. We take and we blow it out with our carb cleaner. Gravity thing took that all the way to the ground. Why are you making such horrible faces, Val? Because it's gucky? Yep, that's because it's gucky. We'll let that drip dry and we'll put it back in the uh, filter housing. So we let our element drip dry. It's been cleaned. A little residual oil from the outside. We simply set it back in. That's right. What? Okay. I'm like, it's still crooked. All right. That's, remember, it had a long thread, man. And we're back on. And just to make it look like something will wipe the outside off. <laughs> That compressor, or that, that is service. Caution, do not underfill it or it won't filter properly. Do not overfill it or it will pull the oil into the compressor and end up downstream in your compressed air. So this is, this line is here for a reason. That's how to service an oil bath air filter on an air compressor. Thank you for watching The Compressor Guru. Like, subscribe, uh, hit that notify bell. God bless. Have a great day. Thank you for watching this episode of The Compressor Guru. Please hit like and subscribe and use the notify bell so you will know when the next new episode is released from The Compressor Guru. God bless you and have a great day.